Hi guys, welcome to my first programming video. Today I'm showcasing a mini project that I worked on during my break from the university. I'm currently a freshman and I just finished my first semester. So, because I had a lot of free time, I got a little bored and I also wanted to test out some ideas that I had. So, in the university we learned Dr. Racket or Racket, which is fairly different than Java or Python, as many of you may know. But as you can see at the moment, I'm showcasing my code, but it's not as neat or as organized or optimized even as it should be. But it's not bad for a couple hours work. I can go back and tidy things up a bit. But as you can see. This is a mini project that I made involving a couple of fishes and a fish tank. I can add a couple of fishes if I want. Display how many fishes are in the tank. Or take away a couple of fishes. Let's make the tank empty. I also made it possible to, to randomize the background, change it, change it up a bit. Taking images from Google. As you can see. There's a fish, you can change the colors, make it all different colors. Make more of the same type of fish. As you can see, there's eight fishes all stacked up on top of each other somewhere. Change the sizes. Make them all different colors or make them all the same color. It's all up to the user. By pressing the R key, it just randomizes all the fishes. So you have a completely different tank of fishes each time, all moving in different directions. I think it's fairly neat. It's pretty amusing to watch all the fishes move around. <laughs> Make the fish tank empty, or you can all have the same type of fish appear. This one's fairly nice. You can change the type of color. It's all randomized, everything is randomized, except for the fish tank itself like the whole casing and everything but everything else is all randomized the sizes are randomized the colors are randomized and it's fairly neat just something that I made in my spare time using the list and structures and racket I can have as many as perhaps hundreds, 200, 300 fishes in the tank but as you can see it's a little laggy so so it's good to just kind of have a couple in there. Size it up. Yeah. This is just a small video. Just discussing. That one's fairly nice. If you guys have any suggestions or anything that I should work on or perhaps implement in this specific program, leave them down in the comments. I'm planning on uploading a couple of videos involving some new techniques or ideas that I have and in, in the next semester uh, I should be learning Java I believe and I'm hoping to do videos on that currently because it's my, it's my break and I have like a two month period I've been teaching myself Python in my spare time and hopefully I'm able to translate what I've learned so far in Racket into Python code and perhaps just move on from there and just keep learning more languages as I move on. But yeah, again, leave any suggestions or comments. And yeah, pretty much it. Thanks for watching and leave a like.